、呃，我是 Jasmine， 然后我是工程一般的土木工程师啊，对，然后就这样。Hey, hello, my name is Daisy. 我叫 Daisy. 然后我是英文老师。然后我很喜欢音乐跟艺术。然后今年二十六岁。嗯，<笑>我的名字叫郑晴欣。然后，呃，我在时间大学读建筑系，今年快要毕业了。嗯，二十四岁。<笑> I came in Taiwan about eight years ago. And first, I was just a student, and then later on, I started to teach English because they wanted some English teacher, and I enjoyed so much Taiwan that I kept coming back. Hi, my name is Yvette. I take part in this project because、um, I'm I really like、um, cultures and like to meet people from all over the world. Hello, my name is Cerise. I'm the managing editor of Asian Life. And I'm not a Shita May. <laughs> 刻板印象的西餐的西餐妹应该是就是会在酒吧里面穿的很辣很辣，然后就是会穿高跟鞋，然后摇摇晃晃，就是跟外国男生跳舞这样。喜欢外国男生，然后会主动跟他们讲话，然后一般的人会想象就是。那个男生会马上就带那个女生回家，然后女生很开心，然后每天换不同男生或什么的，这是一般一般人的那个之的对西餐妹的想法吧。可是当然这不是真的、啊，我觉得。好了，现在人家说西餐妹应该就是像我们在夜店看到，只要看到外国人就贴上去，也不管我认不认识你，反正我就是要黏着你这种。I'm dating now Canadian. <笑> oh,、well, I don't think I'm attracted especially to him because he's Canadian or Western. I guess it、uh, plays a. I guess it in, it plays a role. Can you say that? Role. role? What, what role does it play? I, I guess it plays a role because、uh, because maybe as I've grown up in a Western culture, I might find some affinities, like cultural affinities with him. 我会不会觉得自己是一个西餐妹？我当然会说不会啊。对啊，嗯。所以有没有人觉得我是没有没有吧？别人如果说我话，我应该不会听到啦。但是，嗯，但是我觉得基本上，如果就是一个亚洲女生，她是可能是台湾女生的话，然后她的男朋友是外国人，那就是基本上，就是台湾人，尤其是男生，都会说是她是西餐妹这样子，对啊。大概十九岁的时候，十九二十岁的时候，有一群好朋友，大家开玩笑。<咳>大家会开玩笑说我环游世界，<笑>不会说西餐妹，因为我我看起来不太像西餐妹。So in preparation of this interview, I asked a bit around about Shi Tan Mei or the concept of Shi Tan Mei, and I asked my boyfriend, for example, because for for me it was not very clear. That concept is not very clear, but for him it was quite clear. And then he even said that. Um, sometimes he could feel that people, maybe that we don't know people in the street, will perceive a couple as、uh, me being a shit handmaid and him foreigner dating a, a shit handmaid. But I've never felt it myself before. I don't know. So, I have met with white people. Hmm. But I, I, I don't think he is a white person or something. I think. 最主要是那个文化的问题，就是想法啦。嗯，我觉得说可能比较多，也不能说都是，就是说可能外国人的想法比较，呃，可能比较开放，比较自由这样子。嗯哼。啊，我有跟外国人交往过，<笑>有问题。<笑>就是每个人都有，就是每女女生一定当然有分。各式各样的个性，有人特别喜欢，我特别喜欢吃蛋，我看到蛋我就要吃，这是很正常的、啊。那有一些人他特别喜欢外国人，他他觉得外国人的感觉很 exotic， 异国情调，那他就是很容易就会喜欢。可是那个东西跟那个东西跟他只喜欢外国人或是什么什么，那是那是当然是，就只是一个他特别喜欢什么东西嘛，对啊。男生也会特别喜欢胸部大的女生啊之类的
。可是有很多人会这样做，比如说我今天在，比如说西餐妹今天在夜店看到一个俄国男生，可能他真的知道俄国俄国人是俄国的文化是怎么样，俄国人是怎么样，他可能也不知道，他单纯就觉得是哦是外国人。就于因为台湾台湾的政治立场在国际间比较有一点尴尬，所以像他。可能我们常会说什么啊，什么英国伦敦很漂亮，什么法国男人很浪漫，所以其实是他们既有的刻板印象去影响他们看这个国家的人是怎么样的人，所以他们就会像假设我从来没去过法国，可我今天看到法国人，我就会觉得哎，什么法国好好浪漫啊，怎么样怎么样怎么样，我可能就会这么觉得。那他们肯定是会这样想，因为想象空间比较多。比如说他今天是台湾男生，然后他住在万华，呃。坐在西门町好，坐在西门町旁边那条巷子，我完全都可以想象他在什么样的生活下长大。然后他就住在那，我搞不好，搞不好我还经常经过他家。但因为距距离比较接近，你的想象空间就比较少。可像外国人的话，感觉就是啊，我从来没去过法国啊，所以那我可以想象说，哦，他在法国长大怎么样怎么样？搞不好他也只是个很普通，然后在渔港旁边长大。但是，我就有点，就是是因为人的想象力的关系。Like when you say foreigners, it's it's kind of you're kind of uh, suggesting like Westerners, but I've also dated like Japanese or Korean or some Asian guys. It's actually like um, like I said, I my first boyfriend in high school he's German, and so I went through different phases. I would say like in high school, I was very innocent. I wasn't so exposed to international like any in the world. So um, like at that time, I was attracted to him because he's you know simply white and German. He has blonde. Hair and like blue eyes was interesting to talk to him and learning about his country. And、uh, actually, like in the first couple years in college, I was kind of like that. I, mean, I would go to go to a party and I would maybe target Westerners. But so I, there was a time there was a time I would feel really self-conscious, like、uh, how people may may label me. But like as As time goes by, I become more experienced with life in general. I meet more people, so I start to make peace with that. I start to understand that、um, it's not just about it's not just about like dating. Where's foreigners? It's about like meeting people. I mean, like my interest in culture, I I think it's just like、uh, interests.、Mm, it's like a person's、um, how do you say? It makes a person more interesting. And、your diversity. I dated a、uh, Chinese man, and、uh, she was dating so many guys, and she all the time foreigners. And she was really to me when I met her, it was supposed to just be like for one time. But I stayed with her, and she started to still date other guys while I was with her, and I kind of got angry at her and tell her that she could just go and let me alone. And she was no, I want to stay with you. And she couldn't understand why I was upset that she was dating some other guys. But little by little, she understood that. And what I feel is, she used to be like a really confused person, but she didn't know about that. She was really innocent, and she just wanted to. To have fun with someone and all of that, and the thing is, like, also a father is really is、uh, not somebody who has a, a good job, but his way of thinking is really old. He got married really young, and so one time when she was kids, she just saw a father just saw her talking with one boy in the street. A father just came to her and hit her and kicked her in front of other classmates, and that was, I think, really shocking for her. And I think it kind of destroyed in her the image of the father that is Taiwanese, that is good. And so she was looking, she's looking maybe for something else in order to like repair that because she doesn't want to get married with someone who is going to like beat her up or something like that. 会说他是西餐妹，就是说今天他可能也不是说爱上这个外国人，跟他在一起，可能就是可能现现在社会比较开放，可能就觉得啊，比如说我今天跟外国人上过床，或是怎么样，他的人生的战绩又多了一笔，这波像炫耀炫耀的炫耀的心态比较多吧。所以我觉得我们台湾就非常就是欢迎国外的文化，就是进来我们台湾这样子。
，然后我本身也觉得这是一件好事情。但是如果，呃，就是如果这个限制如果很越来越越来越没什么限制的话，越来越简单的话，就变成说，如果有大量的外国人想要进来的话，这样变成说，我们我们自己台湾的文化可能就会被有点被就被呃。有点有点被就是侵入到这样，可能会有一些这样的问题，我觉得啦，就可能就像说，也许西餐美越来越多啊，然后台湾男生可能就就不到女朋友啊，还是怎么样的啊，就是会有一些问题啦，对。其实其实其实如果有真的有大家都用这一点看，是觉得我会觉得其实蛮糟糕的，因为为什么？因为。纵使他们是真的在交往，他们就觉得啊，那那女生是西餐美。为什么？因为她是台湾女生。那假设男生是美国男生，那为什么？因为这、就是我觉得国国家跟国家之间，大家觉得啊，美国比较厉害啊，怎么样怎么样？然后台湾就是一个小岛国，然后又现在经济又比较不好。扯远一点，你就会觉得台湾在国际之间很弱势，所以大家的看法就也同样，台湾也会觉得说啊，什么台湾人不如美国人，所以就会有一种女生去贴男生的感觉。那我是觉得。这点比较，就有一点 p e r f e c t 就有一点可悲啊！就是台湾人也是这样看自己。我觉得一开始该跟教育有关吧，<笑>就是很就是就是最基本就是教育都教我们外国国外的东西很好啊，然后国外的红酒很棒啊，比米酒还好，比高粱还好这样，或是。一定要会讲英文啊，这样子就是很英很国际化嘛，一定要国际化啊什么的。然后大明星也都是外国人啊，所以好像外国人就很特别。然后可以出国坐飞机去美国玩，好像很棒这样，或是有男朋友在德国也很棒这样<笑>之类的，就听起来一切都好像很特别、很酷这样，嗯。I don't, I don't have any. That's the thing. I don't think that Shita may exist. <laughs> why? Do, why? Do, so. I mean, exist as it is described like that, as it is so so simple. I don't think that 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 now. I mean, maybe it, it happens that some girls would would maybe marry a foreigner, just uh, just maybe for a nationality or passport, but but it's not like a I think a tendency or a trend. A group of women, like maybe it's isolated cases. 其实我觉得这个现象慢慢在改变啊，但是，但是还可能还要好几年之后才会，就是这种现象才会消失